My name is Sasha Uratovic and in this next video I am going to walk you through a topology builder for communication server 14 beta. In the first step we are going to open a file that we have previously created with a planning tool. We have to assign it a default SIP domain and once we are done with that you can see on the left hand side that the stub of our topology has been pre-populated. We have to make some changes. We'll start with a SQL store. First, we are going to give it a new fully qualified domain name. And we will use a default instance. We are going to do the same or something similar for the file store. We will give it a new fully qualified domain name and a file share name. It's worthwhile noting that a file share has to be pre-created. Now we are going to change our focus to the edge pool. We have to make some changes and in order to do that we'll click an edit button. First, we're going to assign it a new internal pool edge fully qualified domain name. And after that, we will do something similar for the external pool fully qualified domain name. We will leave all other settings by default. Next, we'll make some changes to one of our edge servers. We are going to click on an edit button and first we are going to give an internal name or fully qualified domain name to our edge server. Then we will change an internal IP address and following that we'll do something similar for the external IP address. In the next step, we will make some changes to our Enterprise Edition pool. We have to give it a new fully qualified domain name and in order to do so, we'll click on an edit button. Please notice that a file share and associated edge pool have been already pre-populated with the values that we've assigned earlier. In the next step, we will make some changes to one of our front-end servers. More specifically, we have to give a fully qualified domain name and we'll use all other defaults. Finally, we have to make some changes to the simple URLs. There are three simple URLs we have to change. First, we will make the change to the dial-in simple URL. Next, we will make a changes to the administrative access simple URL. And finally, we will do similar for the meet simple URL. In the interest of time, we have made changes to all of other server roles and the result you can see on the left hand side. As you can see, there are no more yellow triangles, meaning that topology is valid and ready to be published. And this concludes the demo of Topology Builder for Communication Server 14 Beta.